Welcome to Sports with Charity Chambers. Charity. Sports with Charity Chambers. Now here's your host, Miss Charity Chambers. Howdy, welcome to Sports with Charity, or Aloha, have a flower by it. <laughs> I'm Charity Chambers, and today I'm going to be starting a new segment. I'm going to be giving a preview of all 32 of the NFL teams. So day by day, I'm going to be uploading a new video of a different team. So you're just going to have to stay tuned to see when I do your favorite team. Alright, so the first team I'm going to start off with is the Seattle Seahawks. As many of you may or may not know, they are one of the last teams to join the NFL. So they've been having some rough years. But recently, they've really begun to rack up a pretty good team and produce some great people and some great seasons. So I'm going to start on the offensive side of the ball with Russell Wilson. Whew, what a season he had last year. Now, everybody was focusing on RG3 and Andrew Luck, and nobody really paid any attention to Wilson. And so all the hype was about them. No hype was about Wilson. And he really produced some great numbers. And he's what I like to call, he is one of the elite quarterbacks in the NFL right now. He was ranked fourth highest in the NFL in yards per attempt, behind RG3, Peyton Manning, and Cam Newton, which to me is some pretty great company to be in. And he also managed to complete over 64% of his passes, which is great for any quarterback, and which also made him rank eighth in the NFL. Now, let's go on to the running backs. Marshawn Lynch. Now, whenever I think of Marshawn Lynch, I think of that amazing run he had that one time when he literally broke like nine or ten tackles. Crowd silent now, as opposed to when the Saints have the ball. Oh, look at this run! What a run! Marshawn Lynch! Still on his feet! Has blockers now! He's dancing his way! For the touchdown! Now, to me, that was his breakout moment. That's when he finally realized, that's when he finally, you know, said, hey, this is who I am as a running back in the NFL. I am going to be a, a decent running back for the Seahawks. And now they have a rookie court, a rookie running back coming in, Kristen Michael, former Aggie. Whoop. So I'm hoping he gets some playing time because I'm very hopeful that he will be able to produce some great numbers when he's out on the field. Now, on to the wide receivers. They acquired Percy Harvin this offseason from the Vikings, and I'm really excited about that because Percy Harvin is a great wide receiver, and he's going to be a great addition to the offense for Russell Wilson. And you have Sidney Rice. He's been having knee problems lately, but we'll see how the season goes and if he's able to play, but I'm sure Russell Wilson will be able to still produce great numbers no matter who he has as wide receiver. Now, let's go to the defensive side of the ball. You have Chris Clemmings, who had 11.5 sacks last season, and they just acquired Cliff Averill from the Lions, and he had 9.5 sacks last season. So they're going to be looking to him to be kind of like one of the key players on their defense. And also, Bobby Wagner, in his rookie season, he was amazing, which was last year. Last year, his rookie season, he did amazing. He had 140 tackles and three interceptions. So they're going to be looking to him to even step it up a little bit more and still produce amazing numbers. And now they did lose Alan Branch, but I believe that they will still be able to produce as good of a defense as they want to with the players that they have right now. Now, let's talk about the cornerback for the Seahawks. And when I say his name, you'll know why I said it like that. I'm talking about Richard Sherman. Now, the infamous, famous, whatever you want to call him, he's not personally one of my favorites because he has a smart mouth. He says things that he shouldn't. But I'm sure his players don't mind as long as he's getting the job done on the field. So they're going to be looking to him definitely to be one of the difference makers because he's one of the best cornerbacks in the NFL right now. So they're going to be looking to Richard Sherman to really produce some great numbers on defense. Now, as far as the playoffs go, I do believe the Seahawks will at least make it to the second round of the playoffs. And I'm saying this before preseason, before anything. And this is because I do truly believe that they have the proper personnel to be, I'm going to go ahead and say, to be a Super Bowl contending team. I do believe that they will be that great if the season goes as planned. They really, they really built up their team to be where they need to be, I believe. All right, guys, that's all I have for the Seahawks. So watch, be looking out for my video tomorrow to see if it's your favorite team. And don't forget to subscribe. It only takes one second, literally. And... Post this to your friends on Facebook, followers on Twitter, whatever you need to do. You know, shout me out. Whatever you feel like you can do to help me out. All right, guys. 
I'm Charity Chambers, and thanks for watching. That's C2 with Sports for You.